being developed right here in the valley that syncs up with a microchip to help track down missing people. We'll put it on my kids. Now, Amanda Goodman is live tonight with details on that app and the very personal story behind it. Amanda? Well, you know, the whole idea behind this here is to be able to find people as quickly as possible, and this new app can help do just that. So here's how this all works. You buy this microchip, which is about $10, and register the person who will be wearing it. That syncs up with bloodhounds. So if they wander off or get lost and it's reported, it'll ping people's phones, letting them know that someone is missing in their area. Then you'll get another alert if you're actually near that person who's missing. Now, the idea came to W. Scott Gray of Phoenix about a year and a half ago after his own panicked experience. His dad, who is showing signs of Alzheimer's, went out to walk his dog and ended up missing for 36 hours. He was eventually found miles away from home, dehydrated, but alive. It could be go with a silver alert or um, even, a, like I said earlier, works for with autistic kids and um, pretty much anything. It's just a, a small tool that you can use to help a lot of people. Again, the microchip tab itself costs about $10. Gray's dad has it on his keychain now, but you can sew it into clothes or put it in shoes. And the app itself is free to download and use, and it's getting a lot of attention. Gray is actually in the running to win the city of Phoenix first ever hack, hack competition, I should say. And that will give him a lot more exposure and help him get Bloodhound fully off the ground. We're live in Phoenix. Amanda Goodman, 3TV.